I had a man once on my church board that when everyone voted for something very positive, like, uh, you know, let us pray for God's good to be upon the congregation, this man would stand up and vote the opposite way. And once I went to him and I said, why? Why are you doing this? And he said, well, he said with his back up, I, I don't want to go along with everybody else. I don't want to agree with everyone else. He had a stubbornness inside of him, bless his soul. It has been said that a man's greatest enemies are his own apathy and stubbornness. Sometimes we can be so stubborn that it's not for our own good or for those around us. Proverbs 29 verse 1 says, Whoever is stubborn, after being corrected many times, will suddenly be hurt beyond cure. Now this hurt does not come from God. <laughs> no, we hurt ourselves by acting in this way. Well, the Bible records since the days of Adam and Eve, human beings have been strong-willed and they have been stubborn and rebellious. Our rebellion stems in a large part from an intense desire to do things our way, our way or the highway, instead of God's way. When we choose to step off God's path for our lives, we do ourselves a profound injustice and will suffer because of our stubbornness. God's Word instructs us to be humble, to not be prideful, to be obedient, and not rebellious. God wants us to do things God's way, but for good reason. When we do, we'll reap a bountiful harvest of blessings, more blessings than, than we can count. God has created a world in which we reap what we sow. May we sow seeds of obedience and reap God's blessings. Best story about this is of a little girl that her father wanted to give her a $5 bill and offered her a $5 bill or a nickel. And she wanted that nickel. She held on tight to that nickel. He said, but let me give you the $5 bill because the little girl wanted a certain toy. No, said the little girl. I'm keeping my nickel. And started to cry. Don't take my nickel away from me. Well, that is the way it is when we step off the path of God's good from our own strong desire to be rebellious and stubborn.